Steve McCann from PhillyGangCalendar.com, and I'm here with Mink Stoll. We just finished watching Eating Out 3. How did the show go? It went very well. Thank you very much. I had to miss some of it, but when I got back, the audience was laughing, so that makes me happy. Well, this was the first time you saw the movie. Yes. Yes. It's, it's actually the first time anybody's seen it. This was an initial, sort of, it's kind of a preview screening of Sneak. Okay, what did you think? How did it come together? Did you like it, I liked it very much, what I saw of it. I didn't see the whole thing. Did you I, snuck I out? I, I, well, I had to go out. I had a, I had an obligation to go out. I didn't leave because I didn't want to watch it. So I had an obligation. Yes. Your friend Johnny Walker was in the lobby. <laughs> and my friend Johnny Walker stole it. Yeah. <laughs> was in the lobby. No, I, I had to go. Yeah, no, I had an obligation, so I had to leave. But I came back and everybody was laughing. And what I saw, I liked very much. It was as I expected. It because I was in the second one. So I expected it to be sweet and, and, and raunchy, but sweet, and it is. Now, you've been doing some of these gay flicks with John Waters. You've been known as every John Waters film. All but a couple of shorts. Yeah. Damn him for those shorts. <laughs> <laughs> but I do, I, you know, I've played the mother of the gay in several films. I was in a movie called Girl Play, where I played the mother of a lesbian. I was in a movie called uh, But I'm a Cheerleader, where I played the mother of a lesbian. I've been in Eating Out 2. I was the mother of a gay man. You know, I mean, this is a role that I play. You know, I'm the kind of typecast, as, you know, the so you mother just, of the gay. You just don't like heterosexual films? I would make a heterosexual <laughs> I've made several heterosexual films. Um, names escape me at the moment, but... <laughs> no, I mean, I just made a movie... No, actually, I guess you called it... Like, the, um, I just made a women in prison movie called Stuck, but there's lesbians in that, and then... That doesn't count. The horror movie that I made. I made a horror movie called All About Evil in San Francisco, uh, directed and written by Joshua Grinnell, otherwise known as Peaches Christ. He's gay, but the movie's not. Okay. Based off of All About Eve? No, it's not. Men like? it's, it's actually not based on All About Eve. It's just a good title. It, no, it's based on a woman who inherits a movie theater, and in order to keep it alive, in order to keep the movies, you know, the, the theater going, she has to make snuff films. <laughs> It's very funny. Yeah. It's, a, it's a real life story, right? Oh, absolutely. Yes. Okay. It's a documentary, isn't it? <laughs> so, of all the different characters you played, talk about what was your favorite character? Well, my favorite character that I've ever played was Tappy Davenport in Female Trouble, and that was a long time ago. And I've lo I love every character that I play when I play it. And actually, the the um, religious person that I play in Stuck is very close to my heart, but I'll have to wait and see how it turns out. But I love Taffy. I love playing Taffy, and I like the way Taffy reads. I like Taffy on screen. There's some characters I like better before they're actually on screen. And this is not your first time in Philadelphia, correct? No, I did a play in Philadelphia here uh, about 20 years ago called Sister Mary Ignatius Explains It All for You, and I did it at the TLA. So you're always out and about, you're clubbing a lot in Philadelphia, you're going clubbing tonight, <laughs> no. no? I don't go clubbing. No wild hangouts for you? I don't, I don't no, go clubbing. No fun no. hangouts for you at all? No, no, no. You no. just kind of stay in your little home. Well, I don't live here. I live in Baltimore. I live in Baltimore, and I took the train up this morning, and I would take the train back to the morning. But yeah, I lived in L.A. for 20 years, and I lived in New York for 10 years before that, but I have returned to my home in Baltimore. And one thing we ask everyone is, what is your favorite game movie of all time? I have no idea. <laughs> I can't. Besides your, this own. One. Besides your own. Eating out free. <laughs> all you can eat. I, I don't know because I don't really, I don't go to gay movies. I don't go, I love making horror movies and I don't go to them either. So it's, I don't know. I, take a pass. I'll take, yeah, pass on the, every one of them. <laughs> I, I'm not, yeah, I don't, I don't, I, I, here's my political statement. I am looking for a day when there isn't gay movies or straight movies, when they're just movies. But they're not as much fun. <laughs> it's not nearly as much fun not to slot them. <laughs> okay. Great. Well, thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Thank you. Good idea, right? Yes. Thank you.